I'm Fallon, and today on Pins Do Stand, we have a special Easter experiment we're going to do. Now, we're going to be seeing how the vinegar affects the color of the egg when you dye it. So, for this, you're going to need four cups with the little color dyes. Let me show you it. And then four eggs, water, a half cup, one tablespoon, and vinegar. Now, we are going to add zero tablespoons of vinegar in this one, so that means none. Zip, none. And this, we're going to add one. Make sure it's level and nice. You might need to move the bowl a little bit. No. I didn't really add one. Okay, that's one. That's roughly one. And now we add two on this one. One. And now three on this one. One, two, and three. Okay, now once that dissolves, we are going to add a half cup of water to each cup. Now we can start with the zero one because, well, there's no vinegar in it. There's nothing to dissolve. And make sure it's filled to the brim and you don't spill it. Yes, a half cup. And then, which one looks like ready? So the green one looks like it's ready. Okay, the one, the one tablespoon. I did not, I definitely did not add up. Yeah, that's that one. Then, this one looks ready. So is that one. Alright, and now we are going to gently put an egg into each bowl. Okay, and now we wait. Okay, it has been 15 minutes, and now we are going to take out the eggs. Now this was the one with zero vinegar, and it's got a couple splotches on it. This is the one with one tablespoon of vinegar. This is the one with two tablespoons of vinegar. And this is the one with three. Whoa, it's cracked. I might have dropped it too hard, guys. Now, my conclusion is the more vinegar you have is the more dye it will have on the egg up to a point. And now, I'm going to explain why this one is green. So we had these little pellets, and we thought they were all blue. But one of them actually turned out to be green, so that's why this egg turned out to be green.